Chào Intercourse với The Frenchals Mời quý vị vào lại nhà hàng em hôm nay Vietnamese doesn't sound as elegant, does it? Oh, hello Intercourse and The Frenchals It's Doll, welcome back to my kitchen Damn, on takes me I'll be serving you the Steam Siege Toxicroak deck A Pokemon that's immune to damage And you're like, how are you gonna win if you can't even hurt this thing? So, there's a trick to it and a trick around it, which you'll see in this video. So, I'll explain to you how this pretty cheap deck works, and you're gonna see it in three awesome matches. For you, we'll put it that way. For you, that is. So, let's get started. All right, Toxicroak, main star. He's a criminal, a smooth criminal, who likes to poison other Pokemon. It's okay if you poison other Pokemon, it's just not human, so remember that. And what's the best thing about anything that's poisoned? They can't fight back. Well, in Pokemon Battles, that's great! So, poison enzymes prevent all damage done to Toxicroak by your opponent's poison Pokemon. And only one Pokemon can be poisoned, so we just need a way to poison the Pokemon. Poison Jab does a low 50 damage and only half chance to poison the Pokemon. So, great ability, he just can't poison them himself. Again, just only half the time. Half? I don't like half. Let's make 100% of the time. Ariadel's his best friend. Sorta. Poison this, it poisons the enemy Pokemon and Toxicroak. So, I don't know what happened between these two guys, but... Yeah, that's not good for your Toxic Crow. Not for us, that is. So, we gotta solve the problem. Let's use Chaos Tower, where, depending which side you flip the cards, your Pokemons cannot be poisoned. Yes! Or, let's see, I can't even read the other way. Confused. So, those don't work. Or, yeah, that's, that's to keep your Toxic Croak alive. So, otherwise, he'll die in three turns. So... That's the combo. You poison with Ario Dose, he's immune to damage, and you fight them. There's only a problem. There's one single window which everybody gets when to hit the Toxicroak. When he knocks a card out, a new one comes in. You can't use the ability to poison it right away. So there's always a window which Toxicroak can get hit. There are other windows too, such as you can just remove the poison with trainers, with retreat. And that's something your opponent's deck has to deal with. If they got it, uh-oh, they're screwed. But, well, you just have to see about that. Okay, so I'll leave it at that. And let's go on all oh, the rest of the deck. I talked to you about the specifics. Let's see if there's anything actually specific this deck I want to go over. Okay, Bridget. I mean, come on, take a look. All your Pokemons are basics. You want to get them out quickly. Bridger gets three of those straight onto your bench. So you be good. You get your Sushi Master. Lots of free cards. Lots of draw power. And yeah, of course, Ari those Toxic. They're your main Pokemon. Most at least a Spinarak Krogok. So you can use all your level balls, all your Ultra Balls to evolve them. You're going to need lots of Pokemons. This Trainer Engine will quickly get them out. Let's see. We got... Escape rope switches because they all have terrible retreat. Two, uh, two, yeah. Float stones can't cover all of them. We have the fighting strong energy boost. Your toxic strokes damage by 20, each of them. So you can either have 70, even 90 damage if you get lucky, plus the poison added in. So it's actually easy two shot potential, but usually just three shots with the poison included. Now, what items would he wear? XP share. Yeah, because all the good items are gone now, so when one Toxic Rope goes down, he'll give another one good to go. So he just only attach one energy in step two. So what else? Yeah, I have the Psychic's Third Eye, because sometimes I want to get rid of cards I don't need. And I'm going to take a good look at what my opponent's holding, so this is a little optional card. We got Trainer Mails, actually the rest, let's see, Draw Power ends, because Reshuffles is really good with Artillery. Lysander, I think that's everything that's important so what's there to see left is to see this thing in action in good cases okay cases bad cases good luck here we go oh. it's it's worth seeing it's worth seeing you know 
it's been quite a long time that I've seen an actual deck that's based around special conditions. When was the last time? I don't know. I can't even remember. It was like hypnotoxic lasers. Oh, I'm glad those are over. So, let's uh, let's get started. Welcome to another Toxic Rogue match. I'm going to play Before My Body is Dry from Kill la Kill. And what we got here? Oh, yeah, we got Spinner Wrap. We got Sushi Master. Let's go ahead. We need Sushi Master in this turn. I hope that it stays alive. The Spinner Rack does. But... Better safe than sorry. He may have a DCE and then I will be screwed if I cannot get the poison in. So, let's go ahead and grab the spinner rack out and hope things maybe uh, won't be so bad with the next draw. I probably will be forced to discard this toxic croak, which is okay, but this is a safe move. I really don't want to do it. I just don't think it's gonna live, you know? So, and even if it's poison, this thing still hurts a lot. So, how many... Just one Toxic Croak, maybe two Toxic Croaks. See, I knew it. I knew it was going to happen that I was going to get KO'd. I know everything. <laughs> no, I didn't. But I got it. So, we evolved the Toxic... No, we need the Sushi Master. Sushi Master, you, we need you now, man. So, it's like, wait, I'm ready to cook. Oh, I think he's ready to be cooked by Lugia. No, don't, don't comment on the situation. You just get me the cards. Come on. We got the Aria Dose. That's good. Do we need another Rim Raid? Kind of like, why not? Oh, yes. So, I am going to go ahead and toss the Sushi Master off. I think there's bench space. I think. I could use Poison Up. I don't want to use Poison Up. It looks like I will have to use Poison Up. Unless this is an Ultra Ball or Level Ball. I have four of those. Come on. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, we're going to go ahead and we're going to use the Poison Nest. It shouldn't affect me. And I'm going to use the Level Ball. We're going to go ahead and find... Um, yeah, I want to evolve it so it can't hurt me whatsoever. And it can't one-shot me. And I get to attack as well. Oh, yes. This is the beautiful, beautiful setup. And it, I think it's already time to use this because I killed too many Toxic Grook. No, I don't want to bring a Spinner Rack back. Yes, I have to... I have to bring the spinner rack back. And so you don't like me? No, well, not right now. So, 50 damage resistance heads. You're already poisoned anyways, but now you're even more poisoned. 60, it's gonna go down the next turn. And it can't even hurt me. So now he has to retreat into a poor Lapras. That, this is the most wonderful setup ever. I like this. I love this. So, it's like, what do I do? Dude, I don't know what your deck, man. Maintenance? What? Maintenance? You're not, you have to use Archie's Ace and Hole with this, which it could be, but it is gonna heal it. Remove the effect. Oh, that means, well, Poison Enzyme doesn't work. And we got Gladly. Oh, this will one-shot me. But luckily, and I, I don't have any EX Pokemons in this deck. It's so cheap to make. So we got... I don't like you. I'm glad you're going away. But 60 damage. Oh, he's out of cards. I can end for... Mm, I don't know if I want to do that. So, I need another Pokemon. Oh, I don't have any basic energies on me. Which kind of sucks. Oh, that's nice. Very convenient. You know, I'm just going to dump this. I know I don't need it. Let's just go ahead and play it out. There's nothing I can really, really need to do. Let's just go ahead and poison you. Actually, there is. But, let's go ahead and see what this is. What is this? It's an Ultra Ball. I'll have to go ahead and take the Ultra Ball. Just cause, so I can get the Toxic Croak Ball. We're gonna go Poison Jab again. 50 damage with the Poison. Come on, gotta get rid of you. Are you gonna, ready? It's got the pressure, it's got the fighting resistance. So that's why even with these two things, it doesn't feel so strong. 40 less damage, completely negating this effect. So I just do regular damage. So now, you do have the option to retreat. If you have a DCE, either of these Pokemons can attack. You just lose the energies, and I wouldn't be able to do anything. Except poison. <laughs> and he can't get around this. Wait, what, what did he... Oh, he knocked out the spinners. When did you knock my Pokemon? I never let, let that happen. Okay, so this player is slow, and I don't want to... I'll just... He's stuck. We'll just say that. He's stuck. At least. Oh! 
There we go. Retreat, not gonna let me get the KO. So, do you have anything there? No, nope. this is just to buy time. I'm not gonna end Fighting Fury Belt back on this. And Mega Glally, wow. I haven't seen that in a while. So, you know, I think I discarded Lysander. I don't care. I mean, you're giving this for me for free. I'll just go ahead and take it. But I do need Pokemons. So I will discard these two very valuable cards. I, he may have Lysander in the future. I don't know, but... You know, why? Boy, take your chances. Okay, we're going to put a Toxicroak up. We need energies because we cannot attack if this very close to death Toxicroak goes down. Makes sense, right? Wow, I'm just getting all the strong energies. Excellent. And we can get another Sushi Master. I'm, why am I getting it? Well, if, if one goes down, that's fine. And I just won't draw a card I won't need in the future. So, are you poisoned? Yes, you're poisoned. I get two more cards. I'm not going to deck out. And I'm not going to end. And I don't know if he has a... He should have some rough seeds. So, we're going to go ahead and take that 90 damage. Poison at the end of his turn. Wow, very convenient. That means he, I just get a free hit and whatever. But he's stuck. How many ends do I have left? One end left. I don't think I have another Verse Seeker, so my draw power is actually at... Uh-oh, and you're gonna go and get a Lugia up! Ooh, the poisons. Who? I don't know who's gonna send up. Ooh, he's so stuck! Just reveal this hand. Just waiting for a draw supporter. I finally get my final, uh... Well, well, first prize card. And at this point in time, Toxicroak is gonna be ready to go. So, item lock me. Psh, let's just go ahead and do this. You got nothing in your hand. And I should psychic eye get rid of these two cards. But you know what? We're just going to poison this. Can't hurt me. And it's it's not that. It's just he's stuck. He is stuck. 90 damage. Two shot KOs. And next attack, two prize cards. Okay, now I'm feeling sorry. Uh, baby, I wish I would have just end. So, let's see. Trainer mail! Maintenance! Maintenance! Oh, you pulled sick and more! Good for you! Good for you! Here we go! So, yes, sick and more. Seven more cards. Like, you know, at this point, I'm in easy mode. Everybody's set up. Everybody's so easy to go. Now it's like, yes, destroy me when I'm set up. That's the critical part. You gotta get me when I'm set up. So, uh, potion heals it up. That's. Well, I guess there's nothing to dump in. It's gonna die next turn anyways. I think. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna go down. So, who's coming up? Poison kicks in. I'm gonna send this Toxic Croak out because this guy has that particular item. So, we can use... You know, this is a good time to use Psychic's Third Eye. I do want to see what you have. Oh, you can actually heal it? Ah, uh, he played Sycamore. That's why he couldn't uh, play that. But that's good to know. Okay, I've stared enough at your hand. So, we don't need Bridget, nor do we need this. And we gotta grab two more cards. Energies, I love energies. Okay, so, Poison Jab. Do 90 damage. And the Poison kicks in, finishes this off. Two prize cards, yay! We're gonna go ahead and grab it. And I, I think I saw an energy. This guy's gone. He's like, yeah, time to get rid of you. And then I'm gonna have to pay retreat costs. And new Toxico, ready to go. And the Poison, you know? Maybe, uh, oh, you can't have the stadium. There's a stadium shrine of memories that lets you use the other attack. His attack is actually stronger, so he's gonna heal it up. Shouldn't you wait till you're not poisoned to do that? Okay, this is match, matching the hand. Okay, it's, got it, got it. I thought it could be like Yanmega. Wow, no energies to attack. That is unfortunate for you. And you just burnt the poison up. You know. So, oh, you're still alive, man. That's good. Congratulations! You don't even need this energy! I'm just gonna go save it, guys. Cause he already can get it somewhere. So we're just gonna attack it, resistance. And you're back to where you were started. And, well, I guess if he didn't play it, he would've got KO'd. No. Oh, no, you still got the Fighting Fury belt. You've been okay. He's got the energies, but he cannot hurt this. Yeah, now you should've saved it. Cause, oh, you got, could've got the KO. So, I'm all good. We're just gonna go ahead and just poison jab this again. And just let you have your turn. Uh, yeah, now... Yeah, you should retreat if you really... You can't... 
Yeah, but he needs another Pokemon to get ready, and it's gonna it's not gonna be KO this turn, so. Alright, so level ball. I'm thinking if I don't, if I don't, let's see. He gets burnt. No, it's not 20. It was 20, that means I get to do the little same trick again. Now I can retreat, but I really just want to get rid of this guy. Just let me give me your prize cards, man. Now, what is the problem with his deck? When you see this, what is wrong with this deck? You need more Sycamore, she need ends. You need Verse Seekers, there we go. Okay, well, hmm. Otherwise, you should be stuck for so many turns. I'm, I'm thinking, uh, you know, there's always, always a chance that you could be bricked. But so far, if, if it keeps happening, I mean, you have that problem, then you know what to do. Now, Giovanni's hand, you got four cards. You need energies, buddy. And this is a pretty good build because it does use DC acceleration for all his Pokemon. He's going to get the Mega Glally up. If it's poison, they can't hurt me, anyways. And he's gonna play the retreat costs and send out Lapras. I have nine cards left. Tide turns left. Guys, I don't think I have another end to play. Yeah, I do. Okay, I'm good. I could just shuffle all my cards back in my deck. If I need to pull more, we are good. We have no problems whatsoever. We can set up another Toxic Crow. So, we're just gonna use the poison. Oh, remember what happened to the last Lapras? I know you have time. Poison. I mean, you're going to guarantee the, the poison. And if you do replace the stadium, which you should, then this thing, I got another one. I'm good. But, hey, yeah, this is the two shot potential deck. This is not supposed to be a two shot potential deck, but it is. And let's see, Lapras, I get the prize card. He needs a retreat at this turn. Now he's splitting his energies between two Pokemon. I guess he has a DCE ready. So, maybe that's why he. He's like, okay, if I'm going to lose this, then I just send this out. Okay. You're poisoned now. Good luck. Here we go. You're going to poison. And uh, I hope you have something to get rid of this. Here we go. Poison jab. 90 damage. And this meets the condition. Even without this cryo mouth's effect. Even with... He does have 10 damage counters on him. He can one-shot any of my Pokemons already. So, TNO. Okay. There's your draw power. Maybe you were just bricked. Sorta, of, sorta. Of. So it's potion. Gonna try to heal it up a little bit. Ah, that's, that's a mega. It's gonna take more time. And you got the DCE. Good for you. Cry out mouth. Your poison doesn't do anything. That's annoying. This is annoying. Okay, so uh, I have another N. I'm safe. And we're just gonna just do nothing. I'm happy. You can end me. I got two auxiliaries. So, he's a goner. What does he need to do with this? He needs to retreat and hit with, with another, hit with any other Pokemon. But he doesn't have another Pokemon that's ready to attack. So I guess this is what he's trying to fish out. Oh, you do need plenty of water energies in your deck to make that work. So, Judge. Oh, I'm going to have four cards. That's fine. I got two Sushi Masters. I was a little worried about being decked out. Oh yeah, we need one crunk. crunk. We got no solutions. This deck... You should... Yes, now I can see why this deck is dangerous. You're being forced to retreat. If you don't, can't manage that. You need like a Zora arc, or this deck needed a Manaphy. So, if a Manaphy existed, then I would be forced to more prompts. But, it wasn't ready. Yes! So, best case scenario, right here. Seriously. I am screwed. Let's, let's just get on with this. Here we go. Welcome to another Pokemon Toxicroak match. <laughs> I forgot what I was about to say. So this is one of the one of the big guys. And unknown is starting up. Which is weird. Now I do have four stadiums. That's why. Let's go ahead and drop it. And uh, chances of survival on first turn, pretty darn high since it's starting off with an unknown. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and fill up our bench. Excellent start. I couldn't ask for anything better. So I'm going to... I can't do anything else. But he needs to retreat this or he could just let it go. I don't know. Let it go. I don't have a Hex Maniac. The only way I can get rid of a Garbodor 
It's a Lysander it out and try to knock it out, and after that, that Mewtwo would have quite a problem. So, I am uh, set to set up. I hope he ends instead of a. Uh, wow, that's putting energy on. Good! Why? Because that's gonna slow his uh, setup down. Acrobike. Okay, let's see how he's built. Save me from doing it. Give me more cards. They're filler cards. And if I see that. This is pretty. Oh, we got everything set up. Perfect. Perfect. Kinda perfect. I would love. I may be forced to use the poison up. He's gonna discard my stadium, so I'm forced to poison myself. Oh. Did I win the guy? Accidentally won the game? Made you look. Even the best decks, they can break out like this. Okay, bye bye. I'm totally gonna stick this in to troll you. Infinite retreat. That looks bad. That looks bad. So, well, nothing you can do about that. I could just try to get this started. So, welcome to another Toxic Crook match. I'm gonna play, hmm, Kiorn Haykins. We haven't done that in a while. Okay, so, do I trust the front Pokemon? I trust you. I trust you. I'll go ahead and toss this down. I'll switch it so then I can't... I was like saying, oh, what happened? So I cannot get poisoned. And maybe if he doesn't have anything, I'll just go ahead and burn this frog down on my next turn. I do have an energy, but I'm delinquent. You jerk. You jerk. I mean, you could have played a draw sporter or something, but he decides to open it up with that. And did he burn up much? Luckily, I still have one. <laughs> wow, I gotta be careful about that. So now I am forced to poison myself, and I'm gonna wait for <laughs> Sycamore. You wish you played that, didn't you? Okay, we're gonna wait. Did you have all the cards you need? I hope not. Well, yeah, take that, jerk. Let's go ahead and put this right here. So when it gets knocked out, this guy gets it. And we're gonna go ahead and poison both Pokemons. I'm definitely gonna get KO'd by KO myself. So we're both poisoned, but you're poisoned. You're going down within two turns. He's gotta retreat for 40 damage. That's great! And now, I'll, I'll, I'll pretty much die at the same rate. I may just have to pull a retreat or something. No, I hope he KOs me so I get the energy, but I'm bricked. He has a Sycamore. And he can just stick a Zora Arc in and just nail me. Oh, it's only gonna do 40 damage. Let's see, this Zora Arc does have a problem retreating because it doesn't have the float stone quite yet, but maybe if he does, that's gonna be it. That's gonna be it. My strategy is up. So, this draw to the Sycamore, I can repeat it even though. <sighs> is it slowing me down? Kinda? There's the float stone. So, gonna jump in. And remove the poison. I don't have any way to remove that, so I think I'm screwed already from this point. But we'll see. Is if I get to attack, he's weak to fighting. Then I'll be okay. He's got the DCE, okay? So that means I'm gonna get KO'd. And he can just retreat next turn, jump back in, and it's gonna be okay. So I need to pull a draw supporter big time. Fighting theory belt onto that size for toad. Mind Jack! Select an energy card. Yep, we're gonna grab that. We can poison you, but he's just gonna mind jack me for enough damage. So, I think I'm bricked. I bricked. No, I didn't brick. That's good. So, we got a Sushi Master. Alright, Sushi Master, you're up. I, I think I'm gonna have to poison. I mean, there's no choice. We have to. We have to. There we go. Now, let's go ahead and grab out the Sushi Master. I hope I can evolve this Pokemon. I can evolve this Pokemon. What else? Yes. And perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. What am I going to play? First of all, I'm going to play this. And grab out the this so I can poison jab, get rid of this, and it's not going to be a problem. Yes. And now, what am I also going to play? Psychic Sturda. I don't need, I kind of do need a Bridget, but I really want the energy to get the KO. Who else do I need on my bench? I guess this is big, but N, 
Just pull me in energy and we're good. Let's do this. Let's do this and... Darn it. Darn it. That didn't work out so well. But we're gonna go ahead and drop out the second Sushi Master. And at this point... I'm gonna hold. He can get rid of the poison. <sighs> There's nothing for me to do. That was just bad. That was just bad. I have 11 energies in my deck. I just needed one of them, and that would have been okay. But now he has... He can get an easy KO on this. Which is... That means I have to throw out the Sushi Master Wait, So, Hex Maniac. He's like, no, I don't even have to retreat. But that means you're gonna be poisoned. He has to retreat anyways. He kind of wasted that, but... Poor Sushi Master. I'm gonna I just have to send you out. In fact, I should have just thrown the spin rack out. So unlucky. So unlucky. Can we catch up? Yeah, if we can nail this Zorark, it's gonna hide. But I need my energies. So he's gonna get the KO. I'll be able to end and maybe slow him down a bit. But that's just gonna be that. So if there was a retreat, I would have loved to retreat too. All right, so, ah, uh, I don't know where my uh, two Crocs of Croaks, I'm going to play the Super Rod after this guy gets knocked out, so I can get my Toxic Croaks back, and because I need more of them now, and, so, okay, let's just, he finally, he got the KO, and I missed that Pokemon, big time, so, what am I going to do, yep, I was going to play Super Rod, and hopefully, let's see, we need we need both these Toxic Rooks, and uh, yeah, I need that. So, here we go, and just to get another one on the way. Let's go ahead and grab this card. <sighs> Alright. Bench space. If I need some time, I'll toss out Spinarak. So, Hex Maniac is up, that's why I couldn't do that. I want to say, you look familiar. Hmm, wonder why is that? That is all I can do. I'm gonna go ahead and toss my stadium down one more time. See, uh, see what uh, what he does. If he does a uh, delinquent again, that's okay. So, I'm po poison's already up. Don't have to do anything. We're just gonna wait this. It takes a little damage, and hopefully, I think he should retreat and try to fight with a different Pokemon and come in and just snipe one of these Toxic Croaks. But we really want a Lysander at this point to go and just one shot and get rid of it or sushi master can stay up there it's all fine it's all good he's got free retreat uh oh an item lock can't really do that so there we go there's the retreat evil toll comes out and it's gonna try to hit my fish just give me the lysander and we're good we're good it's like i want to say you look familiar hmm i don't know so oblivion wing who could i be let me go ahead and Alexander. You're in the next 20 cards of my deck. I need you, man. I need you to show up. Please help me out, buddy. Help a buddy out. Nope, not that card. This may have a chance for lice. I'm coming for you. First of all, I'm gonna retreat the sushi master. You're gone. You you missed the chance. You uh I mean you can send anybody out. I'm just gonna Lysander. I'm going to get rid of this frog, and he's going to be able to punch me for 40 damage, which I can take 40 damage. And okay, you can send that out. I'm going to send my Toxic Croak out, and then I'm going to go and grab this card. I'm going to go ahead and poise. I don't really need to poison you, do I? I better just do that just for good luck, you know. And uh, yeah, good luck. Let me go ahead and pull two more cards out. I don't want to Ultra Ball yet. I I think I don't want an Ultra Ball yet. Hey, a new Sushi Master! Awesome! So, that means I get a free card. I don't want to lose my energies. I mean, that, those were kind of rare. That's trainer Mail. We're going to use the Poison Jab. You are weak to fighting, so I'm just going to get the KO off you. And I'm vulnerable to whatever comes next. And if I need time, I'll toss the Spinner Rack out. And you, none of my, my Sushi Masters are safe. Both of them are out there. Awesome. Seismitoad is up. It's got a fat retreat cost, and it can't use this grenade punch. So, I'm going to be locked for items, which I'm actually okay with. Remember, how he needs to win is he needs to retreat. So, 
I'm okay with just an item block. But that gives me time to get this out. Uh, uh, you know, I should have thought about that. So, 40 damage. Ugh, I can take two more hits. It's just okay. It's okay. It's all good in the hood. All right. We got a Toxic Rope. I can end. I think I'm good. I don't really want to end. So we're just going to go ahead and poison. Make sure that he can't hurt me. And I'm going to go ahead and poison jab. 70 damage. A little, a little more poison. He's gone next turn. The retreat must happen this turn. And now without Sushi Master, I don't know what actually help. Why is this guy here? Acrobike. Okay, so maybe there's an Archie's Ace. I don't feel that's uh, good for now, but Quaking Punch again. I'm item locked. That's okay. I don't need to do anything. I'm all good in the hood, guys. We got another energy right here. I don't... Are you poisoned? You're still poisoned. Yeah, let's go ahead and poison jab. 50, got rid of ya, poison comes in, and that's, um, that's not even two prize cards. So the poison, at the end of his turn, he has to retreat at this point. Otherwise, i will get the first hit. Battle Compressor, oh, you should already be thinking about your next deck, man. I mean, I mean, you're standard, because it's gonna happen, you have to take it out, but, uh, I'm providing a standard template. If, you know, if you need to do that, it's really easy to adjust to the next meta. Or at least the next meta. It's easy. It's easy. It's easy. It's just using the cards what you already have. So, what would you battle, Compressor? Probably lame supporters, I think. I mean, this is why else would you run battle, Compressor? What energies? Maybe for Oblivion Wing. All my Pokemons have less than 90 hit points. Which means there's no surviving anyways and he has to knock out four more of my pokemons i don't quite have a retreat he's gonna throw the target whistle out oh, man this guy's got a lot of tricks in his bags you tricky um b drill what, what did you think i was gonna say quaking punch i can't play items because why not and i get the first i get a free hit on whatever pokemon you send out if you send the B drill, now he knows at this point. I'm I didn't plan this out. It just happened. Hey, switch. Yeah, you gotta. Okay. Let's go ahead and. Uh... Oh yeah, I can't play any items. That's fine. We're gonna go ahead and poison you, and I'm gonna use my poison jab. There is resistance, 50 damage, but with the poison in, we may have the similar situation coming out. Yeah, I'm gonna punch him. 50 damage. It may, it may uh, do that, or I can just go ahead and play the escape rope, force the switch, get this guy out instead, and then your evil tall won't have a chance to get a KO. It depends if he drops another Pokemon or not. And now I'll, I'll be free to play my items. You know this. I thought I thought this deck wouldn't give people much trouble. This is a pretty troll deck. Not that it's like. This is a pretty well-built deck, I gotta say. It has got, I mean, everything necessary for a good deck. And maybe other decks would have problem with this. So, I'm, well, Zorark, now I know that I shouldn't be scared as you after all. So, all right, you're gonna play Super Rod. You're gonna want that Zorark back for sure. So I'm pretty sure he has another one. He's just stuck. He's stuck. He, let's see, Shaman. I, this has got to be a Shaman. Shaman's been... I don't know I, why I've been waiting for so long for Shaman. It's prized up, probably. So, uh, item lock. Maybe Shaman's in your hand. Maybe you have Sycamore in your hand. Or you're stuck. And now, at this point, no, I'm not going to play the escape rope at all. Okay. I don't know what to do. Oblivion Wing. Wait, what happened? It should miss. Oh, it, it, it will miss? But he will get the secondary effect and load this up. Dude, I don't have that much damage. At all. So. We're gonna go ahead and play the town map. I'm gonna go ahead and poison jab you. Because I got nothing else better to do. Poison. It kicks in. And then Toxicroak is gonna get knocked out. Great. That's really it. Let's go ahead and put Lysander back into a queue. And he's like, yes, I'm free. I'm going to go and nail this Pokemon and get rid of you. How many more Toxic Croaks do I have? One more. How many Super Rods do I have? None. Oh, shoot. And Sycamore, finally, man, trying to build out the Zoroark. It's coming. 
In fact, I may punch it out. So, okay, Sushi Master, spin a rat. What? That is a problem. Can you one shot me? If I have two bench space, can you one shot me? No. Evil ball. There it goes. So, it can jump in, but it can't one-shot me. Can this one-shot me? Yes! That why This is why the poison has to go in at this time. So, let's go ahead and do this. And let's go ahead and charge up our uh, third in line Toxic Croak. He needs a DCE though. If he gets this card... If I drop this down... Hang on, let me go ahead and remove the poison. Yeah, so there we go. Poison is gone. If you jump in, that effect will not KO me. I need this guy to stay alive, which is why I'm not dropping the next Toxic Rope yet. So heads, poison, 60 damage, can't do anything to me, but he has to jump in attack. I'm waiting for you to jump in. I was just gonna snipe you off, buddy. Or if he has another float zone, that's good. That's That would be very bad, because then I would... Well, not really. I just sniped this off uh, uh, maybe a future turn. Possibly. So, I saw that. Do you have the DCE to charge it up? Or actually, the, the, the bigger question is, do you have the float stone to charge it up? I have an escape rope. I have an escape rope. So, he's going to jump in. And I'm going to actually nail this. No, no, no. A muscle band. Okay. And a DCE. So, you're going to remove the my... Ability to poison. And you can, okay. Do I have another Aria dose I can set up? Nope. Let's just go ahead and toss this down. I'll go ahead and drop you. We're gonna remove this because it has a free way to remove poison. So there we go. And I, you know, there may just be a chance, just one small chance that I'm able to do something. Tails, got it. And I'll grab this card. Now, either of these cards can retrieve. This is the one that's most dangerous, though. So, we're actually in trouble. I hope. I don't know. I don't know. He's going to get KO'd. There's no way I can get the poison back. I think this is the one where I go down. Oh, boy. It's got a free retreat. Retreat again. Do I have a Verse Seeker? Do I have no Lysander? All the Lysanders have been played. I don't see the Verse Seeker, so it may be somewhere. So, if I get the poison up with this attack, it may be okay! But I, now I know why he went for the Aria Dose. I still have a chance of poison. 50% chance of poison. If not, I've lost the game. Unless he decks himself out somehow. So, Ultra Ball, gonna go ahead and discard more cards. What's gonna happen? Should I actually pull the card? Uh oh, this got full retreat. This thing has full retreat. And Maxi's hidden ball trick. Ooh, he actually pulled that card off and got the Gladlade. So now you can set what cards you want. I can end and reshuffle them. But still, this stinks. Uh oh, that means I have to poison myself. Do I have any more stadium? One more. Just one more stadium. So, this is it. If can this one shot me? No, it can't. <sighs> I need to outlast him. I need to outlast this guy, or I need to just attack this. This is the weak point. This here is the weak point. If I KO this, I win, and he has no way to. He can innately retreat on these Pokemon's, but not this. Okay, so. Float stone. Yeah, he's getting ready to retreat that for free. Uh, gonna blast this to bits. Why Cyclone? No, he's gonna use... No, oh, wow, he actually is gonna use Y Cyclone. Pass the energy to whom? This guy? I hope not, because then that means you're prepared for sure. Okay, so... I'm gonna go ahead and throw this guy out here. You get the best of the very best. I'll go ahead and toss this here. 
Let's see if we can actually pull the right cards. Okay. We're a little desperate, okay? I can... This is guaranteed to KO me. These guys... If he sends this out, we're in trouble. Let's go, go ahead and switch first and see what move he makes. Let's see what he makes. Nice combo. I think he's feeling confident at this point. He's like, yeah, okay. Who are you going to send out? Are you going to send this card out? I'm fishing for the light Xander. I kind of was waiting for that. So let's go ahead and do that. I don't, I don't have the Lysander at all. We're just going to go ahead and just do the... This is the best case scenario. He needs another energy. He only has one card. And I've got this. Now, okay. So let's go ahead and use the Abyssal Hand. I'm okay with the... I really want the other Lysander. And... I don't like your stadium. I'll go ahead and drop this right here so I can't poison myself yet again. Got so many energies. Let's go ahead and use Poison Jab. 90 damage if he can't retreat. I got this. I'm going to say thank you, but if he has the energy, I've lo I think I've lost the game. If he has an energy or a retreat. If he does not, this is it. I'm going to actually... It'll be GG, okay? Because I know I've got nothing left. Premonition, take a look at the next uh, cards. He may have had the cards in his hand. I don't know. He actually, if he has an energy, he can just use a uh, sensitive blade. No, he needs to play a supporter. So next five cards, you can pull. I mean, you only have six cards left in your deck. <sighs> I can use poison up. Um, do I have another tox scroll? Nope, this is my last tox scroll. I'm out of gas. I can't attack with this. This is out of gas mode. We're on our last prize cards, both of us. He's gonna pull the retreat. Drats. Lucky. The end pulled them the right card. Okay. That's his last prize card. Good game. Good game. Whew, so close. So close. GG. Well, it looks like you made it to the end. Thank you and congratulations. So it is time we rate this deck and it gets us. A 7.5. You know, I'd, I'd say it could stand with the 8, but as you can see, there are counters. There are counters, and once you get how this thing works, you can get around it. They're very, very squishy, and then it just depends if you can outlast them and just refresh the frogs before everything goes out. So, are you going to win? Sometimes you'll catch somebody off guard. Is it going to be consistent? I don't think so, especially once, you know, cat's out of bag. I know, I'll just deal with it now. And that's, that's just Pokemon. So, that's just uh, why it gets the rating it gets. Now, what is up for next time? It's going to be Rayquaza. Where are you, Rayquaza? Uh, which Rayquaza? We already got the Dragon Rayquaza, so why not the White Rayquaza? He's been around forever. We do Dex videos of this guy pretty much every couple of months. So, let's get a new standard up. And, of course, this is going to be one of the biggest search deck. It's going to be around destroying everything. So, we got to cover you again. I was like, I don't mind. I'll kick all your Pokemon's butt. If I'm steering this, I'll feel very confident. So, that's up for next time. And, new music. I'm going to put, actually, the song that you're listening to, Hero Academia. The intro to that. It's now in the playlist. It's now on Spotify, iTunes. And guess what? I'm going to try to do one new songs each month. In fact, then one next month, you'll be listening to it real soon. It wasn't in this video, but probably the next couple ones. So, actually, you probably heard it one time before, so you're paying attention. And, well, all those songs can be found on Spotify, iTunes, playlist, 
Did you forget to say, uh, yeah, do like, subscribe, because this video is awesome, isn't it? And there's more videos to come, so thank you very much. Integrals and the Frenchers. I'll see you back in my kitchen next time for Mega Rayquaza. Ah, faster intros, faster endings, better, better, better. Okay, thank you, goodbye.